Well, we had some uh, on and off clouds and sun today, but it was a good day. All those people out at Potter Park Zoo, a good day for the zoo. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. And really anything that you chose to do outside, it was a nice one. We had very comfortable temperatures. It wasn't humid outside. And yes. other than just a couple quick passing showers, it was dry today. So very nice day indeed. And we'll start off the week pretty much the same. Take a look Good. at these high temperatures today up in the upper 70s for all of mid Michigan. A few people did make it to 80, 81 in Lansing and Hastings, Hastings 80 as well as Ann Arbor. Now these temperatures will be just a little cooler tomorrow. We expect a little more cloud cover and we'll also see a better chance for showers not only tomorrow but also for Tuesday and Wednesday. We'll talk about those in just a minute but let's take a look at local temperatures in the low 60s already. So it's really cooled off especially off to the north and we've seen a few less clouds than what we've seen to the south so I'm expecting it to cool down quite a bit quicker off to the northwest as opposed to the southeast. And let me show you that satellite and radar. You can see on here that we really have the cloud cover just off to the south and off to the north. We aren't seeing a whole lot. So I would expect in general partly cloudy skies off to the north and towards the south, maybe mo mostly cloudy skies. And we'll all see more of those clouds forming up once we get into Monday. Hourly forecast for the overnight shows 63 by 11, 58 at 6 a.m. and 9 a.m. we're up to 65. We'll be traveling to those mid 70s once again, but it's still going to feel very nice and comfortable outside, although a little cloudy. So typically we're about 82 degrees this time of year. We're going to be a little cooler than that to start off this week. We will make it back to the 80s eventually, but first a couple rain showers and those are going to take us all the way through the 4th of July. Unfortunately, we haven't been able to keep the rain out of the holiday, but it looks like after the holiday, drier and warmer temperatures are going to filter in. So it looks like we'll see sunshine for next weekend. Temperature trend though, take a look at this. A couple days with a cooler than normal temperatures and we're finally back to right around normal territory this time of year by Thursday and Friday. And we'll be into those mid and upper 80s once we get into next weekend. So very comfortable temperatures to start and a little more humid toward the end of the week. But the 48 hour future track will show you we are tracking some of those showers in just the next few hours. Monday morning starting off with dry conditions, but notice that the green showers are down there and a few of us could see those creep in, especially from the south. Now, once we get to Monday afternoon and evening, it looks like the direction is going to come from the southeast for those showers. So if you're in the southeastern counties, you've got the better chance to see those. Notice Tuesday morning we're seeing more of those showers as that low pressure passes on through and we'll see that sh chance for the showers and possibly storms continue into the evening. A lot of those are going to be done by Tuesday night, but we have another chance coming on Wednesday. 57 for the overnight, mostly cloudy, should be dry tonight and a mostly dry day tomorrow, but a few of us have a chance for a shower. 77 degrees for our high and we'll see those 70s continuing on into Thursday and we'll see those temperatures finally bounce back to right around normal by the end of next week. We've got a lot of dry days in there. Notice that even though the 4th of July doesn't look entirely dry, it should not be a washout by any means. So parades looking good. You may just need to bring the rain gear with you, but Friday Saturday looking fabulous for everyone that's enjoying that long extended weekend. I'm not liking the rain chance on the 4th. Oh. I know. Well, <laughs> it's looking questionable, so it could easily come as well as go. So just keep yourself posted and we'll let you know what the rain looks like the closer that day gets. Okay. And, and heating up, but nothing like what they're seeing out in the western half of the oh, country. Oh, certainly not. And thank goodness. Yes, uh, 117 okay. in Las Vegas Unbelievable. today. Unbelievable. All right. So we'll save that off for a while. Yes. Right. All right. Thanks, Laura. <laughs>